Welcome to Night Prayer with Father Matlack, your evening call to prayer. Pray with us every night, right here on the podcast and in your inbox. Learn more at goodcatholic.com slash night prayer. As we end our day, let's do so in God's presence and begin our night prayer. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Jesus Christ, my God, I adore you and thank you for all the grace you have given me this day. I offer you my sleep and all the moments of this night. I place myself and all my loved ones, wherever they may be, in your sacred side and under the mantle of our Blessed Mother. Let your holy angels stand watch and keep us in peace. Amen. Psalm 33, that great Eucharistic psalm, ends with the following verse. The Lord will deliver the souls of his servants and all those that put their trust in him shall do no sin. Every time we sin, every time we commit an evil, especially those of us who are baptized Christians, we do so because ultimately we turned away from God and we turned to something else. We've made a false God our inspiration and our guidance. So the psalm is teaching us that in order to avoid sin, we simply have to trust in God. That's to say, we simply have to remember that he is God. We have to dwell in his presence. And if we do that, no matter how long the battle is with that particular temptation, ultimately we will not sin because we will cling to the presence of God. If we do fall into sin, for whatever reason, it's because we turned away from that however small or big that that turning away might be. Small for little sins, great for for large sins. So what's the message of God if we have fallen into that? Well, how did he begin his gospel? He said, repent, convert, which the word convert literally means to turn around again. If we've turned from him, we just have to turn back. Turn back to the presence of God and remember that he is there waiting to call us home. Let's put our trust in the Lord today. Now I invite you to examine your conscience. Firstly, give thanks to God for all the benefits that you have received this day. Secondly, Ask God for the grace to know your sins and to be rid of them. Thirdly, take an account of all the sins that you have committed during this day in thoughts, in words, and in deeds. Fourthly, ask pardon from the Lord for all the sins that you have committed. Finally, make a resolution with God's grace to amend your life. Finally, we end with the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thanks for listening today. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Night Prayer with Father Matlack is a production of Good Catholic, the media division of The Catholic Company. For more faith-filled podcasts and videos, visit goodcatholic.com.